Hey everyone, so I saw a lot of people making this type of video and I really liked them. But the thing is, most people are like, buy this, get that and use this and you'll be great at making videos on YouTube. Now, call me frugal but I don't like spending money necessarily where it is needed and many seen on YouTube. You spend exorbitant amounts of money on software and hardware that you are not used to yet and then you suddenly get overwhelmed when you have all the equipment with you but don't know how to use it. We're gonna divide this video into seven segments which are in the order that you need the most to which you need the least. You can click the segments in the player to jump right into them. So starting our list is a decent computer or a laptop. Now it's always nice to have an amazing computer with 32 GB of RAM and 8 gigs of graphics but many of us don't have that. We either have a low medium spec PC or a laptop that we use for work or if you're one of those holier than thou people, a Mac or a MacBook. In which case, don't worry, most of the things listed will work just fine for you. Now coming back to us peasants, try to get a PC with a dedicated graphics as integrated graphics cause a lot of processing problems in a lot of video editing softwares and a processor which runs anything above 2.20 gigahertz cause a bad processor just slows everything down. I made this video on a PC that had 8 GB of RAM and 2 GB of graphics and has a processor of 2.16 gigahertz and 2.44 gigahertz when overclocked. Coming on to our second thing, you need a video editing software. This is the most debated topic on the subject, I think. Personally, I prefer Adobe Premiere Pro as it is very easy to understand when you learn it properly. The cost of Premiere Pro ranges from $19.99 per month to $31.49, but you're gonna need Photoshop with it, which we'll talk about in the next segment. And if you don't think you can afford any of these, ask someone for support. There's always that on the internet. Number three, a screen recording software. This is optional. If you want to record stuff like gameplay, screenshots and other things that play on your computer, you can have a screen recording software. Personally, I prefer Bandicam as it's really fast and captures images and videos instantly in high quality. It costs around $39 for one PC, but there's always the option of asking your friends for support if you don't have any option. Number four, a photo editing software. Congratulations, you made your first video, be it a meme video or a funny montage, you did it. Now the question is whether you're gonna upload a dope thumbnail yourself or let YouTube decide your video's fate. I prefer Photoshop the most because it's the industry standard and is an amazing tool for dope thumbnails. I'm still learning, yes, but I saw the potential of Photoshop the moment I started editing my first thumbnail. Now Photoshop comes at the price ranging from $90.99 to $31.49 per month based on your plan. I heavily suggest that you go through the scenic route on this one too. Number five, a microphone. A microphone should be given more priority as compared to a camera in my opinion because many people are gonna click away from your video if they find your voice unsoothing. I was facing the same problem myself. If you see my past videos, you can clearly see the difference now between the audio of the past and this audio. I was recording on a phone back then. It had several issues like picking up background noises, statics, plosives, etc. But getting a good cardio and microphone really ups the ante and it's not that expensive either. After a lot of research, I came across this wonderful microphone and it's around 69 bucks on Amazon. It records my sound beautifully without any background noise from afar and it's just wonderful. It comes with the whole kit with the stand, the pop filter and everything. I'll put the link in the description so you guys can check it out. Number six, the camera. I put the camera last because you can make a YouTube video without it if you want to. You need a PC and different softwares for editing and a microphone for recording audio. But a camera isn't that necessary at all until you want to capture your face or record a cool backflip to show the world how flexible you are or give people the motivation to break their backs. Now you can go for a camera that has a good quality and easily be managed, I suggest you go for a Canon, most preferably Canon EOS M50 camera, which costs around 500 bucks. But like I said, it's not necessary to buy a camera until you want to record stuff around you. So take it easy at first. This is easily the biggest hurdle I've seen YouTubers face. They get so confused when they start making videos, learning from different videos, online courses, websites, and in all of that, 
they get even more confused. Well, let me make it simple for you. If you want to learn basic video editing, go to Fenzar's channel where he teaches you how to edit pretty awesome videos, in my opinion. And he also teaches how to edit thumbnails in Photoshop. And it's it's really amazing, to be honest with you, that he is creating such quality content to educate people about video editing in Photoshop. And if you want to learn how to record and shoot stuff with a camera, I suggest Peter McKinnon's channel, which is amazing. And these people will basically show you how easy it is to learn these skills in almost no time. I'll put the link in description to both of their channels so you guys can check it out. Now in the end I'd like to say that it's really awesome to know how many people really want to learn this stuff but it will take patience and practice to master all of these things I told you guys and I hope that you do master it and share your amazing creations with me. On that note Please don't forget to like and subscribe this video. It really supports this channel. I'll be back. 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 Bravo 6. Going dark.